if you're applying at the u.s embassy for a u.s visa so for example if you're applying for an f1 visa to come and study in the u.s and you need to submit a bank statement then please be careful of where you get the bank statements from these days the u.s embassy is actually not only denying visas of people but they are also putting permanent bars on people a permanent bar means that you can never be issued with any type of u.s visa you can never get a green card you will never be allowed into to enter the u.s unless and until you seek a waiver and these people and the bank statements sometimes do not exist and sometimes the bank statements do exist but the bank statements have been doctored the balance the account balance have been changed or certain transactions have been changed and the u.s embassy calls these banks to verify certain details so you don't want to in that situation and at the you know if you are giving a ban you cannot now claim oh i didn't know so please do your due diligence just to make sure that you are safe i hope this helps all the best for me for more